So I'm joined by Gordon Elliott, who has told us all about all his good stars that are going to the Cheltenham Festival. However, we're going to talk to him about the Cheltenham Festival because you've got a lot of experience about yeah. the Cheltenham Festival. Um, what's your sort of favourite thing about Cheltenham? Actually, this is one of them places you love going over to. The atmosphere is second to none. To have runners in it is great. And just, I just can't wait, to be honest, yeah. Is there any particular place that you really like enjoy eating or do you have a ritual or something? Ah, listen, I stay in the same house every day. I sleep in the same bed for as long as I've been going to Cheltenham. Um, do you know, we, 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 go, we, we have a bit of a routine. A few, a few, me and a few of our friends, we go to the same restaurants and same pubs for, for a drink. So it's uh, really looking forward to it, yeah. Do you remember the first time you went to Cheltenham? I, uh, it's a long time ago. I can't tell you what year it was. I went over to a horse called Perinap at Tony Martins. Uh, I think you might have finished third or fourth in the Grand Annual. But it, that's a long time ago. That was that was when you were riding, or that was when you were working I was there. Working with Tony Martin, yeah. Uh, I can't remember what year it was, but it's a long time ago. Um, it's obviously changed a hell of a lot since then, including the stands and the stables and stuff, and your own stature. So, yeah. do you feel different going? I know it's something I look look forward to going every year. Obviously, you get a little bit nervous when the time comes, but I can't wait for. It. Now, your big, big star that everyone's talking about is Apples Jade, um, and she is looking great this morning. She's in great form. We're very, very happy with her, so just hoping we get a clear run for the next three weeks and everything will be okay. And we spoke earlier about the fact that she was in season and, and sort of the lengths you have to go to, how much you have to watch her to yeah. try and make sure that that doesn't happen again. That's right, yeah. It's something we'll monitor very closely and hopefully everything will be okay, but, you know, touch wood, it'll be okay. Is there anything you can do, like diet or anything, to kind of... Ah, uh, listen, not really. We're working with our vet, veterinary surgeons closely and making sure everything's okay, but it's something that you just hope doesn't reoccur, you know. And then you've also got a runner in the Gold Cup as well, Shattered yeah. Love. Shattered Love in the Gold Cup. She, she ran well. She obviously won the GLT last year. Um, so, listen, I've got a great team of horses going. I can't wait. But there would be two of your like, major stars. Uh, they, they will, yeah. So we could have opened 50 horses going over, but they're two for the main race, so we're looking forward to. Thanks a lot, Gordon.